hair stuff. <laughs> Not really good, but you know, gotta get it up in the out of the face. We're at Streamline CrossFit. About to work out. We're gonna do a hero one, a partner one, which makes it more fun. And everything is alternating, so you can only do one rep at a time before your partner goes, which makes it, I think, way worse. Because then you can't let someone that has more strengths do more of the work. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we got a good amount of people showing up today, which is good. And then uh, after that, photo shoot time. Well, actually, we got one more wad to do after this. Still yeah. no waiting on. No, you can. So two ways of doing the wall balls, guys. So you can either just throw it up and have the partner catch it. If you're ready for the next one, throw it up. If you feel like you can coordinate with your partner, or throw it up, drop it for a second, catch it, throw it. Or if you have a male female partner, you'll just have your own wall ball in your hand and just hold it while the other partner is going, and then throw it. Okay. Is there any questions on any of the exercises? Yeah, you can split it up. And for the hang hold guys, it's together. So if one partner drops, the other partner has to drop. So you accumulate a minute together. Questions? Any questions before we start? Still waiting on Ben and Tessa. But we'll probably start. Everybody should clap when Ben comes in. So you can either do co-ed or female female male male is in San Antonio uh, Two-day competition. Yeah, three days. Well, it was three days because they got multiple positions. Oh, like, they okay. got kids, okay. masters, and, and, scales, and they're doing scales, individuals too. Yeah, yeah. But uh, so I was like, you know what? We need to do some partner wads before that competition. So that's why every hero wad on Sunday right now leading up to the competition is partner. So I started <laughs> With. Oh yeah, a minute hang hold. So you had to do it together. So if one person dropped, then both of you have to drop and wait. Um, and then you went into a hundred alternating burpees, a hundred alternating box jumps, a hundred alternating uh, wall balls, wall balls. <laughs> and then switching every five for the dumbbell thrusters. And then you did another minute hang hold, and then 50 of everything, another minute hang hold, then 25 of everything, and then another minute hang hold. <laughs> Sweat my eyes, box jumps. 
like in here. Dude, I was sweating so much in there. I don't know why. I saw that. I, I was doing the like... same thing. Like when I was jumping, like we were jumping in tandem, like she was next to me. And every time I jumped up, it was just like sweat and like charmers <laughs> uh, <laughs> all over the place. And I don't know who was standing right in front of me, but they just got showered with all of my I feel like <laughs> last year is when I started sweating more. I feel like I never started, I feel like I never sweat that much. You finally went through puberty. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Guys, the I, started <laughs> I really started sweating a lot, like profusely, like it's bad. <laughs> Buddy's house, oh, okay. oh, have a baby baby house. Yeah. and I just drilled him, and now there's a <laughs> knot on his head like that oh, big. Right. <laughs> oh my god! I didn't know he followed me, and I just swing <laughs> open the door. You just about repeated it on Bella's. <laughs> I don't know. I almost drilled her too. <laughs> How are y'all doing today? Good. Did you sweat <laughs> out all the white cloth? Oh, I sweat out hours. everything. I sweated everything all out. All the white cloth. Like, how many oh. white cloths did you have yesterday? Total. Oh, yeah, that's white cloth. <laughs> Total, probably. 15 all day? What? Yeah. 15? I had 15. Are you doing that while you're mowing? I did I did have two white claws while I mowed my own lawn <laughs> yesterday morning and then it was twelve o'clock and we went and bought twenty-four of them and went to town on it all day. He came to a party last night at like ten thirty. <laughs> yeah. With like a pack of white claws. He was like, You want one? I was like, No, I don't want one. He just like walk in, it's like, White claw, let's go! And then he left like thirty minutes later, he's like, I'm out of here. White claw, no law. I actually don't like them. I Why? Had, like one sip of one one time. You like the Trulies, don't you? No. Mighty swell. No. Jack no. Daniels and Coke. No. You don't even know me. Get out of here. <laughs> so we're about to do a photo shoot for Born Primitive. Uh, hence the outfit change. I have many outfits to do. Um, it's for the fall collection that's coming out here soon. And so we have Richard, one of the photographers out here, shooting me. We're gonna go around Austin and just do like Austin-y things. So he wants to go to Salt Lake, so we're gonna go to Salt Lake. And Hop Dottie, it's two big restaurants that are like known in Austin. So we're gonna go do that. And whatever else we can get into. Maybe the Capitol, trying to go to the Capitol, do some photos there. Anything else? Go. people that did get cut yeah. and like that kind of like feeling of oh man these are my my, my fellow competitors 
and I feel bad, but I'm happy that I made it. Yeah. Is that I felt kind of weird? I felt guilty almost. I was yeah. like, because I, I know there's so much more for me to work on, and I have so many weaknesses still. And so, especially like when I made it into the top ten, and I couldn't even clean the first weight, I was like, I even deserve to be in here, kind of thing. That's like what me and Haley were thinking. Mm -hmm. But when Dave Castro sat us down and we were 20 going to 10, he's like, okay, now that we have the fittest, let's test strength. So that kind of made me feel a little bit better. But yeah, it's like, I still don't even feel like I got eighth place because I have so much to work on. I'm like, I feel like I don't even deserve it. So I definitely felt guilty for like being Sarah that's gone second at the games or third yeah like it's just crazy so it's, it's kind of crazy crazy bad. year yeah i mean it's been a bizarre year noah didn't even make it through the open I know. or you know what i mean and he came and in second so like it's crazy it yep. blows my mind so what are you uh what are you guys about to do what a blues online qualifier i don't even know what the workout is i know it has rowing thrusters and burpees in it so which I like all of them, but we also just did about 500 thrusters and burpees, so <laughs> like they're kind of done. <laughs> and then she's gonna do a max lift, and I'm not gonna participate in that because I'm broken constantly. Okay, burpee over the rower, yeah. Burpee over the rower. Oh god. Okay. Oh <laughs> god. <laughs> you wanna do it, Chase? <clears throat> you see, I gotta, I gotta hold the camera. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd totally be down. <laughs> oh man, this is gonna get rough. Can I have the bomb out? <laughs> Alright, never mind. Should we play? Ooh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Got some Skrillex in there. Stir fry. That one's that one's the bomb. I like John. Money in the grave. That's a good one. Wait, hold on. Wait. 
What's the move now? What's the move? Uh, we're gonna get some food, take Richard to some Austin-y place to eat, and then we're gonna go downtown and take some lifestyle photos. Where are we going? Hop Dottie? Get, get a burger? Yeah. Okay. And my fanny pack. I'm basically like an adult baby, so. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like I have my life together, but I don't. Yeah, when we're out in Madison, um, we were supposed to get a minivan because we had about six or seven people with us. And we got out to the lot and the guy was like, hmm, I don't have any more minivans. Uh, I'm just gonna upgrade you to a Traverse. I was like, okay. And it was like a brand new Traverse. It was super nice. I really wanted that minivan though because I had a fanny pack and my Crocs <laughs> on. So it would have been like the best combo ever. Now are you originally from mm -hmm. here? Technically, I always just tell people I'm from Austin because I was born Excuse in Florida, me. but six weeks after I was born, we moved to Austin, so I'm like, I don't, I don't remember it anything. Count. Yeah, like, so I've been here since I was six weeks old. So I'm like, I'm an Austinite. So my dad and my mom, when they got married, they moved out to Florida because my dad had like a job opportunity. And then there's four of us kids in the family and all of our family lived back here, and my mom was just like, I need help. Yeah, Because sure. <laughs> she had four under the age of five. And we were just like back to back, and we were wild children too, so. So I'm gonna go to Argentina in December, and then do Cape Town in February, and just call it a year. And then next year, maybe do I don't know, like two different ones that I haven't been to. Just so I can not have any regrets and I'm older being like, damn, I wish I would have gone to Ireland or France or something and I have the opportunity to go. But for you, is right now the goal to make it through the Open? Is that like yeah. the goal? And yeah. then as we'll see what happens with sanctional? Yeah, as long as my body holds up, like, as long as my back pulls 100%, then I'm able to do every workout twice in the open and hopefully have a better opportunity. But I guess that was like the suckiest part about doing the open. Oh, sorry. Now you're good. <laughs> I got a breakfast burger, truffle. Thank you. I got a prime time, sweet potato fries, non gluten bun. There's non gluten. There's no gluten here. There it is. Thank you. The goal is definitely to make it through the open. But if it doesn't happen, it's okay because I'm all the backflip spots. So it's like you don't do so well, or you get like I don't know, 40th or 50th. You still have a pretty good chance of being like the top 20 from the open. So and honestly, I hate online qualifiers. So is what it is. All right, how was? How was Hop Dottie? Real good. A he, plus. Gives it, he gives it a big thumbs up. Alright, out of 10 ranking, oh, power yeah. ranking, what do we got? 10's the best. Uh, I'm going to give it a 9, and that's only because Ooh. I didn't have a milkshake. I think the milkshake would have put it at a 10, but yeah, I'm trying to pace been, myself. But then so. you would have been like this the rest yeah. of the day. And I'm kind of like that already. So. Photos are going to be real cute now. Where are we at? We're at the capital. Oh, I can't really see it. <laughs> We're at the Capitol. See what this burger bod can do. <laughs>
All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. Thank you so much. Uh, I guess what I was gonna say is do one uh, running across the street, one just kind of like hanging out in the street. Just like that. And then maybe a handstand walk across the street, if yeah. you're okay with that. I can do all of that. Yeah. Okay. Um, you gonna run? Let's do it. Yeah. There is a, a line right in the middle where the yellow line is. There's oh. a line uh, lined up, and that'll put you right dead center with the Capitol building. And then we could do a uh, handstand on that line. Okay. But when you kick up, face the Capitol, so that when you kick up, you're looking at me. Okay. One more with the flip. Good. Nice. Oh, awesome. You want to do a handstand walk one? Yeah. Seven seconds. Six. Nice. Oh, All right. We'll do just one more, just standing, just kind of hanging out, standing like this, maybe. You know what I mean? This much. <laughs> Are you in the <laughs> All right. Good, I'm gonna get in one more. Sweet. All right, let's push in. Oh, thank you, sir. Got one fan, guys. What all did we do today? I think we did a lot. I feel like we conquered the world. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so, this morning, we did a hero wad. That was fun. Austin didn't think so though. And then I did another Wadapalooza online qualifier with Emily. That one sucked as well. Then we took Richard to Hop Dotty, which was awesome. And he enjoyed it. He gave it a thumbs up. Boop. <laughs> then we went to the Capitol and I told him nothing about the history, but I tried my best. <laughs> And I got to run in the middle of the street. That was fun. Almost died. Not really. And then uh, came to Whole Foods. Went to the ATS. We tried to go to the graffiti wall, but apparently it's closed down now. So what you gonna do? How's the, how's the graffiti was, wall being closed down make you feel? I'm really sad about it, actually. I was like, man, that was like the highlight of the trip that I had planned for Richard. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. It's only downhill from here. <laughs> What's next on? Uh, Keeping up with the uh, the <laughs> Um, so I think next up is uh, duality. Duality is a partner competition in San Antonio. So Austin, the owner of the gym that I co go to, Streamline CrossFit, we're gonna do it together and hopefully do okay. <laughs> I okay. hope. Fingers crossed. The competition is September 27th, 28th, and 29th. Um, and then the Open is literally two or three weeks after, so Open's October 10th, as far as I know. So that's why I wanted to do it. It's like a competition right before the Open starts. A little hoorah, since we really didn't have an off season, so might as well just continue. All right, guys, thank you for watching my YouTube channel. Make sure you like and subscribe, and catch you next time.